the Town of Hopkinton, we, the Hopkinton Board of Selectmen, are pleased to express our congratulations to, and in order, Gene Birchman, who is the chair, Craig Stanley, uh, Scott Richardson, Hanan Cohen, Michelle Murdoch, Ann Matina, Megan McSkimming, who is the genius who actually pulled off most of the, um, the fall weekend events, and last, and, but certainly, however, not least, Mr. Eric Sonnet, uh, as they are honored by the Hopkins Chamber of Commerce with the Distinguished Service Award for their service and dedication on the 300th Anniversary Celebration Committee. And this is signed under our hand and seal this 9th day of December, 2015. Benjamin Alpaleco Chair, John Catino Vice Chair, John Mosier, Todd Sestori, and Brian Hur. So please join me in, in asking um, Gene Birchmon to come on up and take these, and, and please let's give a round of applause for the 300th Anniversary. <laughs> I think it's been a spectacular year, really. So many people came together all across the community, different groups and people um, to, to pull off more than 40 events. Um, I feel like the town has been well celebrated this year. Um, and it, it was really, it was an incredible time and it was an honor to be involved in it. It was, it was a pleasure. Could you uh, tell us how many hours per week, per month that you, that you spent working on this? It, it, it must have been just like almost like a full-time job almost, planning all these events out. Uh, there were many weeks where, where it was like that, and I, I have absolutely no, I met, no idea how many hours. I can say that many of my days started at 5.30 in the morning texting with Ann Click, because she was always awake and I was always awake, and we started our days that way, and um, together we really accomplished a lot. So I, I have no idea, but the, the amount of hours were absolutely well worth it. Well, you certainly deserve to be recognized here for all the effort you put in, and we're looking forward to the closing ceremony. And thanks so much for uh, such a great year of events from the 300th Anniversary Committee. Well, and thank you guys for covering everything and really for helping us document this um, so that well into the future people can look back and see everything that, that people were able to do this year. And, uh, you know, again, so many people, uh, including you all, that went into making this year a success. So thank you very much. Appreciate it. Fireworks, Tim, unbelievable. I was definitely one of the people that just sat there and the choreographed fireworks with the music and I had the opportunity to go to Boston for the 4th of July this year. And let me tell you, Hopkinton's fireworks for sure were at least three times better than the ones in Boston. So congratulations to all of you. Because after all, it all starts here, right? <laughs> So it is my great honor and privilege to also um, recognize the two wonderful groups here that put so much time, energy, and heart into making this all happen. And we know that these things don't all happen by themselves, even though, quite honestly, um, the two groups that we're recognizing tonight made it look so easy, uh, it was incredible. So um, hats off to all of you. And I would like to uh, likewise make a representative um, dedication to the two uh, heads and representatives of these committees. Um, first to Jean Birchman uh, on behalf of the 300th committee. Jean, if you come up. I, I have individual citations here on behalf of the Massachusetts legislator, legislature for each member of the various committees, but um, I will not read each and every one of them, but I do have them up here. Um, for later. So I will read this and it reads, be it hereby known to all that the Massachusetts House of Representatives offers its sincerest congratulations to the entire 300th committee in recognition of your hard work and dedication to commemorating Hopkinton's tercentennial as a member of the 300th anniversary committee. The entire membership extends its very best wishes and expresses the hope for future good fortune and a hundred more years <laughs> and continued success in all of your endeavors. And one of the wonderful things that Jean shared with me before the event tonight was the fact that Sterling Hager, who was the oldest resident at the beginning of our tercentennial celebration, continues to be our oldest resident at the end of the tercentennial celebration. So, so a tremendous year of events here in Hopkinton. And and you represent a lot of communities, but have you ever seen anything like this? I have never seen anything like it. I, I don't have any other communities that have celebrated 300 years, I will say. But what has been done here in Hopkinton, I think, has set the bar for any other communities that are going to be celebrating. And, uh, you know, the energy, as I said, in the room, in, in the room for all of the events, at the parade, at the fireworks, was just 
um, incredible. And I think that's thanks to the hard work, not only the people that set it up, but also just to the energy and the vibrancy of this community as a whole and the people who live here.